talking about the difference between onshore casinos and offshore casinos, what the risks are in this video, and then you can make your own decision. And what I mean by offshore casinos are casinos that have a license to operate in some country that does not, and that license does not have an umbrella that stretches to the US, but they still allow US players to illegally gamble on their site. Now, right out the gate, I will tell you that there are a ton of advantages to gambling at an offshore casino illegally. However, those advantages also come with risks that I personally don't want to take. Uh, however, if you do want to take them, that's fine. I'm going to cover, you know, what the risks are in this video, and then you can make your own decision. However, if you're one of the people after watching this video who decide not to go the illegal route, in the video description down below, there's a link. That link will take you to my website on a particular landing page where there's a list of casinos that are totally legit. Um, you know, you, wherever you live, you will find a casino that you can legally access from where you live on that list. And what's great is you click on that, uh, you click on whatever casino you want to sign up for, you'll have their best sign up bonus already ready for you. So now why do so many people, including people I personally know, okay, and think I'm crazy as a gambler for not doing it, okay, but why do so many people go illegally to these offshore, casino, to these offshore casinos? Well, for a few reasons. They offer like outlandishly, stupidly generous uh, uh, casino bonuses. You'll see bonuses like, you know, a, a deposit match up to $5,000. And that sounds very attractive. And a lot of people do take advantage of that. And on the sports betting side of things, they have market beating, sometimes market shattering odds that make Bet365 odds look like shit. And to top it all off, here's the real reason, right? They, they genuinely do but like very often pay out. So it's not like, you know, it's not like you're getting screwed every single time you go to every single offshore account. You're, you're, you know, people, I know people who are, you know, gambling money, huge amounts of money on these offshore accounts and they're getting their winnings. They're, they're having no problem with drawing their winnings. But where does the risk come in? Great question. The risk comes in when you do come into a, a problem where you hit a high amount of winnings and they don't pay you out. And there's all kinds of little tricks they do that are legal on their end to screw you over. For example, here's a classic trick that I talk about all the time. A lot of these, a lot of these online casinos will allow you to create an account, being from the US, will take your money, they'll, they'll let you gamble. They might pay out one, two, three times, but then the fourth time you have a big payday, right? The roulette table is really good to you one day and you have $24,000 worth of winnings to withdraw guess what they'll do? They'll say, okay, no problem. We're gonna give you your money. Just, you, we first have to verify your identity. And when you upload your, you know, whatever license, whatever federal federal um, ID that's based in an area where they're not legally allowed to operate, they're going to respond to you saying, oh, sorry, you were never supposed to be legally, op uh, legally gambling on our site anyway, so we're not gonna pay you. And the other risk you run into is this. All of these places doing this illegally, they're gonna get caught eventually. And when they do, they're gonna go bankrupt or whatever government or agency that seizes them are gonna seize their funds. And whatever, you know, whatever your balance is or whatever winnings you're owed, you're not gonna get paid that money. So even if they don't pay, even if they don't screw you over intentionally as a byproduct of them operating illegally, eventually they will. As opposed to when you're gambling at a casino, at an online casino, legally. Well, guess what? The, the sign up bonus might not be that outlandish, but whatever it is, it's legal, it's legit, it's still pretty generous. And here's the thing, if you, if you ever have a discrepancy, there are legal uh, routes you can go to. There are entities and agencies that overlook and oversee and make and oversee these online casinos and make sure, and they enforce these things strictly. They make sure they're fair, they make sure they're paying out, and you can very quickly get them into big trouble. And guess what? They don't wanna get into big trouble because then their license is gone. So because there's the accountability factor is so strong and high with legal casinos, you can rest assured that your information is safe, that your that your uh, money is safe, and that if, if there's ever any discrepancy, you have a legal route to go. You have a proverbial leg to stand on, if you will, if you ever have an issue. Again, guys, for the best casinos that are legal, down below is that link that'll help you out, and I'll see you next time.